Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Our House 21, and this is just a little quick one. Yeah, I've got Miss Robin going to help me out here. And our little puppy here, Lexi, to uh, keep us company. Okay, Robin. Well. All right, so what I've got here, for those of you who have been following the Facebook and Instagram feeds, you've been seeing that I was talking about making myself my quick disconnect interchangeable cat packs. So the byproduct of doing Wait, that. You never told me about this. Well, Robin, you should be paying attention. <laughs> no, <laughs> but okay, so the deal is. I wanted to be able to swap out cat packs in my cars, so I rigged up these connectors so I can quickly plug and unplug them. But the byproduct of doing that is that I can actually plug them together. So what you're looking at right here is actually 13,000 microfarads. Whoa. So basically this thing is a very, very, very large capacitor right Daddy, now. Daddy, there's only a few of them. How can there be over 13,000? Well, microfarad is a unit that you use to measure how powerful the capacitor is. So each one of these is 470 and there are 28 all hooked up here. So really? 28 times 470 is just over 13,000. Whoa, that's a lot. Okay, so what I want to do here, just to kind of show you what capacitor is doing your power system, what? is I'm going to hand... So what that thing right there has to do? Well, this is my multimeter. So Robin, if you hold the camera for me, I'll show everyone. Yay. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is I have my multimeter, and I'm just going to put the leads in the back here so that we can measure voltage. And you'll see that I actually had this thing hooked up a few minutes ago. Really? Yeah. And if you look at the meter here, you can see that this thing is holding six volts right Daddy, now. it looks like it's holding the time. Well, that's, that's the voltage that's on it. It's almost like an alarm clock. No, not quite. So this meter actually measures, well, if you look right here, it, this meter actually measures voltage. That's why it's called a, it's a multimeter. So it measures lots of different things. Oh, look at all the buttons. Yeah, so right now. Focus, camera focus. So right now it's measuring voltage. So if you look at this little lead up here, so hold it right there, Robin. All right. So I'm going to plug this Dean's connector in wow. and watch what happens to the numbers on the meter. So it's going to. Okay. And you see the multimeter's going up to 8.3 volts. And in real time, it's 831. Right, so now I'm going to unplug the cat pack. I'm going to unplug the battery. Uh -oh. oh no! That's okay. So I'm unplugging yeah. this battery. Yeah. And now look at the voltage. So you can see it's actually 8.2, 8.23. So oh. this big capacitor bank is holding voltage and oh, okay, so, so, as you can see the numbers there. numbers yeah so you can see the capacitor bank is actually holding voltage so it is maintaining the vote is trying to maintain the voltage that it was put on but it is falling off oh no yeah. no so what a capacitor does in the system is it stores energy problem is that a capacitor can only store so many electrons so it, it so even though it's able to hold voltage it can't produce a whole lot of current unless it's a really big capacitor really? so so right now you can see the voltage is slowly slowly falling but it's still holding voltage and this thing will actually hold voltage for well it should hold voltage for quite a while actually Okay guys, so I went in, I just grabbed Phil 38, my little robot, just to prove a point. So the capacitor bank is still sitting here and it's holding a charge. And it's been sitting there for a little bit now. I'm actually gonna plug this guy up. The fill is powered by Dean's connectors. So this is some of the guts of fill. Got my connector here. Robin? Robin. Yeah, here you go. Okay. Control for Phil 38. Thank you. Yes. All right. Control him. Okay, so. Okay. So. So Phil's ready. Oh, so, Robin, can you come back over here, please? Yep, I'm right here. Okay, so I've got Phil set up. Okay, come around to the other side, please. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, so. Hold the camera right here. Yes, Phil. Whatever you say. 
Okay, so turn him over. Hold on, hold on. So Phil, so this cat the pack crap. is so the cat pack. Okay, so you're putting the cat pack in there. So the cat pack is acting like a battery right now. Really? Yep. So watch this. So I'm gonna plug the cat pack up to Phil. You are good. Okay, so, so this thing has been sitting for a while now. Really? But it's still holding a voltage. How is it still working? Because capacitors can store energy. So watch this. So I'm gonna flip the power switch. Look at that. Can we see the opposite side of filter eight? The green, the, 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 the special part that I really like. Okay, so I flipped the power switch and the light flashed mm -hmm. on and then it went on. Okay, so now I've actually got Phil hooked up with his massive yeah, cat I, pack. Hey, he's turning into the colors of the rainbow. Okay, so Robin, so hope, watch, keep watching the little lights. Go. All right. So it's a light show, like the show we once saw in the museum. Okay, so I'm unplugging the battery from Phil. Wait. And so I'm going to go three. I'm going to say three, two, one, and then unplug it. And we'll see how long it stays. But I want to see you control him. Oh, Robin. Oh yay. The filter is dancing, yay! All okay. right, that's enough. All right, so three, two, one, unplug. What? Okay. He can do whatever you say. No, I unplugged it, so it didn't actually last that long. So the point I'm showing here is just the fact that even though these capacitors, mm -hmm. they do hold voltage. That's like the inside. They don't. They don't hold. They don't store enough electrons mm -hmm. to really keep going for a very long time. Hey there. Daddy, look, that's like Daddy? Mm -hmm. the inside so, see, so I'm going to do three, two, one. Daddy, I, Daddy. Think, someone got, I think someone beat you to it. Okay, three, two, one, unplug. So it stayed, the light stayed on for about half a second. Oh, wait, I want to see you do the unplugging. I think the others do too. Okay, so here you can see both in the same line. What's that beeping noise? It's just not alert. So three, two, one, and I unplug. You saw the light stay lit for a second. It's beeping noise. All right. So Wait. that's pretty much it. So. Hey, Dad. Look who's got the controls. All right. So our house only one signing out. So, well, again. So these cat packs. The main job is not to store energy for the system. Like they're not trying to be extra batteries. Their, their function in life is to filter out noise or ripple voltage in the system. So they're very good at doing that. They're not necessarily all that great at trying to um, augment or replace your batteries. But they clean your power. They don't replace your power. All right, guys. Our house only one. Nothing out. Remember the mantra: Fly, fix, fly. Break it, fix it. Do it all over again. And don't forget to check me out on Facebook, Instagram, and all the other social media. I need to stay out because we might show videos of Lexi all right. and Nathan right there in the background. All right, guys. So our house only one. Signing out. Peace. Keep on smiling.